Well, hello, hello, and welcome back to my garage. My name is Quad, and on the last one, we went ahead and finished up the suspension on the lad here. Uh, this one, we are going to just right away get started on the engine rebuild. So we're going to try to do this as best as we can uh, off of the end. Uh, we're going to do this as best as we can with it up in the air like this. Uh, so let's go ahead and get this oil pan taken off first. That one there, and there we go. Let's see if we can uh, keep the oil in there. I don't even know if there was any oil in this, by the way. Uh, but there it is. We have, oh, I forgot. You know what? We need to actually replace the whole block. So we're going to pull the engine out. Let's go ahead and drop this sucker. Yeah, I forgot we were replacing the block. And where is the block, by the way? Oh, no. Did we not bring it? Did it get stuck down at the frickin' place? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Hold on a second, you guys. Where did my block go? Oh, man. I left it. Oh, nope. There it is. Thank God. What the heck's it still doing in here? I thought we pulled everything out. Anyway, thought I had a mini heart attack. Okay. So, before we do anything, we're going to grab the move tool and get that engine stand out here. Yeah, that scared me. Uh, I do know we I left a freaking piston uh, down there, by the way. So I am aware uh, I found out during post. Uh, let's go ahead and grab our wrench again, if I could remember where I dropped it at. There it is. Okay, let's go ahead and get the engine onto the engine mount. Indeed, indeed. There we go. Let's open this puppy up and let's... Well, yep. Okay, so what we're going to do is do... A a mix. Okay, let's pull off this valve cover. Indeed. All right. And then we don't need to take off that. Uh, let's pull off the timing chain. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, and the next we will go ahead and take off uh, the ex the oops the uh, exhaust manifold. Uh, we are going to just set this over here for now. Indeed. Okay, let's take off the exhaust manifold. And let's see, what else do we need to take off the head? Uh, we don't need actually need to take off the radiator. Um, we don't need to take off that water pump. Let's check the other side real quick here. We will need to take off the fuel line, however. So we'll grab that right away. Okay, there we go, there we go. And, uh, we, well, we need to take off the wires. Yep. And let's see, is that going to be everything? Yeah, that should be everything for the head. So let's pull the head off now. And... Okay, apparently we still have something attached here. Indeed. Okay. I don't think... The transmission uh, locks to the head. Uh, maybe... Nope, all those look like they're part of the block. Hold on. Uh, maybe the carb? Yeah, the carb. Possibly. I don't know. Let's take it off. There we go. Let's just pull that off real quick here. And... Oh, I missed a bolt. That was why. Oh, I'm a genius. Of course, it's not allowing me to hit it. There it is. Okay, we didn't have to take off uh, the carburetor at all, but we do need a, a freaking, what's it called? Here it is. Head gasket. Okay, let's throw on the head gasket. Okay, let's throw on the block, or not the block, the head. Get that tightened back up real quick here. All right, let's grab the carb again. Lap this puppy on. Check, check, and checky, checky, checky. Okay, very good, very good. Now, that should be everything as far as the top end goes. Uh, indeed, indeed, we can go ahead and not throw on the timing chain yet. No, I don't think so. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and lift her back up, I suppose, and pull off the crankshaft. Okay, so we're going to attempt to get as much done as we can today, obviously. I mean, that's kind of the goal, right? Uh, let's get these off real quick here. 
and bada bing a bada boom okay there we go and of course uh yeah you know what we could do the pistons after we uh insert this or no we're gonna have to do them right away okay let's take off these bad pistons uh one two three four and five six okay let's grab the good ones uh here's one Oopsie. Okay, hold on. Okay, no. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I know you can. Okay, let's tighten it. Uh huh. Uh, we should have one more over here somewhere. Uh, where is it? Nope. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Now, I do remember dropping off the other piston. Oh, great. Oh, there it is. It was right in front of me this whole time. Okay, let's go ahead and put this one on. And then, unfortunately, I do have to buy one piston from the store. Uh, that's fine. But while we're here, we're going to go ahead and pull off this flywheel. So this pressure plate does look good. That other one was really black. So, yeah, this one looks like it's a good pressure plate. Beautiful. Uh, this is definitely bad. So we're going to put a new one of those on. There we go. And there's the flywheel. Let's go ahead and go grab a one more piston real quick from the store over here. We're not going to get it for no 12 or 13 bucks, but I guess that's okay. This will be the one part that we did not get from the junkyard, but I do not plan going down there to get that thing, right? Okay, hey, buddy. Hey, I got a jug for you if you want. I don't. So, Just kidding. My girlfriend <laughs> go ahead. Me. Okay, so it's not too bad. A regular piston's only 42 bucks. Uh, so we're kind of only overspending by around 30 bucks, so that's not the worst case thing. All right, let's get this over here, get this put on. Yeah, so I want to try to get all this done today, uh, the engine and the rest of the body work, right? I figured I'd do the engine first uh, so we could kind of see the big jump once we do the paint. Okay, here is the last piston. Go ahead and tighten that puppy up. Uh, check and check. Yep, there we go. And now we can... Well, we'll put it in here first. There we go. And then we will add the flywheel. Where is that puppy? Right there. So let's get this thing tightened down real quick. Uh-huh. And then we will add the clutch plate that we bought down at the junkyard, right? Check. And the pressure plate. Okay. Let's get these all tightened up real quick. And we will be moving along just just fine okay and this one and that one okay beautiful beautiful okay so only thing we need to do on the bottom is add our uh what you call this thing so let's go ahead and put this on get it all tight bada bing bada boom i should have grabbed the I should grab the oil filter, I suppose. Uh, let's do the timing chain next. Timing belt, rather. Check. There we go. Now we can add on the valve cover, of course. Okay, so now we can just start adding all the side uh, pieces on. Let's go ahead and get this lowered again. And I don't know if any of these were actually good. Okay, we do have a good distributor on here. So we're going to go ahead. Well, it looks like almost everything is good. So let's put the distributor on first. Uh, check. Uh-huh. Let's go ahead and grab that fuel filter. If we could see the bolts. Uh, it looks like they're underneath. Indeed. One, two. And let's slap her on. Oops. There she is. Okay. Uh, one and two. Okay, up next will be the ignition coil. I think this is a good ignition coil. I'm pretty sure the other ones... Yeah, it looks good. Okay, I couldn't tell with that little band there. Uh, let's slap that on. Tight, tight, beautiful. Anything else off of here? I don't think so. I don't think so. Everything else looks like it's pretty much uh, garbage. Indeed. Okay beautiful uh let's find the alternator real quick here where is it come on come on i did grab it i know i did I, oh wait 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 the alternator's already on 
Genius. Okay, okay. Okay, so what are we missing? Um, well, not too much, actually. Let's go ahead and put the exhaust on. And let's take a look. I think that's going to be everything. Let's go ahead and pull this engine out. Uh, we need to do the transmission. Well, let's get the wires first, I suppose. Uh -huh, it's just those three. And then let's do the transmission. And we should be able to get the engine off at this point. So we're going to go ahead and release those. And there she is. Beautiful. All right, drop it. Oh, we need the belt off there, though. Let's go ahead and grab that real quick before we forget. And we'll just slap this on. Okay, it looks like we do have everything. So grab our wrench. And let's just look on the ground real quick. I think we have everything on there. Uh, obviously not the wires. I guess we could put that on. Why not? Right? Right. Okay. Oh, yeah. And the air filter thing. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's get it into the car and then we'll finish it up. Uh, inside there so let's loosen it uh-huh and yep let's just drop it in check oops okay come on we can do it there we go and then this side beautiful uh we might as well pull off the master brake cylinder right why is it not letting me get, grab it? Okay. Oh, the, the hose is probably still on. There it is. Okay. And there's that. Uh, let's go ahead and grab the new one. And it looks like we still have fluid in there. Oh, no. We lost it. That's fine. I will probably put new fluid in. I could dump that other one. Maybe I will. I'm not too sure. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's get the uh, air filter thing going real quick. Check. Now we do have to pick up an air filter, so oops, easy buddy. All right, so let's run across and grab that air filter. I think that's the only thing we're gonna need. Um, we might as well put on the new lower hose while we're here. So we'll drop that one, pick this one up. And there we go, beautiful and tight. Okay, let's go grab the air filter, but we're gonna tighten up these uh, wires main real quick so one two and three tighten up the transmission uno dos tres cuatro okay and that should be it we just need to go get the air filter so let's run across the street and grab that so not too bad i mean we paid what 681 down at the um down at the junkyard and then another 40 up here for that piston 720 air filter buddy and there it is 18 bucks there so that's not too bad 40 60 uh 80 740 so far we've put into this car i mean that's pretty much nothing and we're getting and remember we only bought it for two grand from the the barn find so this is going to be a pretty hefty profit i'm pretty excited about it all right, let's go ahead and throw the air filter in, uh, pick our wrench back up if I can remember where I dropped it. Uh, it's right here. It's not really a good place. Okay, and then we just need to put the lid back on. Oh, wait, where is it? <laughs> there it is. Okay, engine is a freaking done. Uh, let's check the fluids real quick, see how much we lost. We lost all the oil, obviously. Uh, there's the brake fluid. Let's just check the... Okay, and the radiator is empty as well, to be expected. Uh, so we need oil, radiator fluid, and a brake fluid. I don't know if I should use this one again. I mean, why not, right? Why not? Let's go ahead and just go ahead and, yeah, let's just put in uh, this brake fluid. There we go. Pick it up, and let's dump her. Hopefully. Oh, we're missing it. Okay, there we go. Okay, well, we might need to pick up another one. Uh, but it looks like it's pretty full. It's it's in between the lines, so we're good. We're good. Uh, let's go ahead and just put this cap on that old brake line thing here. There we go. And we got to attach the fuel line, of course. Can't forget that. Possibly. 
Okay, there it is. And let's go ahead and tighten her. Check. Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Okay, so should we start it up real quick to make sure it runs? And then we will finish the body. I think we will. I think we will. Let's go ahead and go across the street, get all of our fluids, and get all these things filled up. All right, so we're going to need uh, two oils, one of those, and I'm not going to worry about the brakes. We'll see how that goes. Okay, and let's bag it. Yep. And we'll see about the gas. I forgot it does have an old tank, so we'll probably dump that out and put some new fuel in. Uh, there we go. Let's go ahead and get it filled. Just set that right here. And, okay, we might need to lower this all the way. Yep, there we go. Now we should be able to reach it. And... Oh, oh, we're spilling it everywhere. Okay, there we go. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Uh, look, what is that big old hose? Okay, I think that's for the air filter. I was going to say, what is that big old hose thing sticking out there to the left? Yep, there we go. There's the first one. Uh, we should need two, I believe. Indeed. Okay, let's grab the second one. We should already be in position here. Okay, there we go. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, yeah, this is pretty exciting. I think on the next one, I'm really thinking about buying, like, just a bunch of lads. I, I just want to go down to the junkyard, buy, like, freaking five or six lads, and just get to work on them and get that 50 grand so we can get the expansion. You know what I mean? Okay, there's that one. Let's go ahead and put the lid back on. Yep, there she is. And we will do the radiator next. There we go. Let's see if we can hit the hole here. Oh, nope, we're missing it. Oh, we're missing it. Okay, there we go. Oh, nope. Okay, there we go. So we'll see. I'm not too sure yet. I was thinking also just going to go get some more barn finds, but... Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really thinking about just getting, like, you know, three to six lads. Bring them all up here and get working on them. I think we can only buy, like, three lads at a time, though. I think that's all the room we'll have until we come up here and move them around. Okay, there we go. There's the last of the coolant. Let's get the lid back on. Uh, let's look in there. Okay, it's full. Check. Uh, we're going to throw all this stuff away. No reason to keep it. I should have probably checked those oils first, but I'm pretty sure they're empty. There we go. Okay, so we can... Uh, I think we can probably get her started. Uh, there's no reason to keep it on here, so we're just going to back it up. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we're good. I think we are good. Um, the battery should be fine. Should it be fine? Yeah, I think it's fine. I think we bought it. Okay, let's get it started. Uh, well, I mean, yeah, let's go ahead and look at it first. So it's worth 86 at this point, right? Uh, we're probably going to have to change out that fuel, but let's find out. Oh, Jesus. Okay, it, it starts. It starts. Okay, okay. Uh, it was in gear, by the way. Okay, beautiful. Let's go ahead and finish up this rust real quick and uh, all that. So we're going to need to get our welder uh, right here. Do we have a stick in there? We do have a tiny one, uh, but we're going to have to get some more. So let's grab a box real quick here. And there they are. Six of them. Beautiful. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, take off of this rocker panel real quick so we can get that rust. Um, if it's going to populate here, hold on. Okay, come on. We have a stick on here. Let's try it again. Uh, why is the little marks not coming up? Hello. Okay, we're going to save real quick. Okay, let's try this again. What the heck, man? Oh, wait, is there a stick in there? Is that the stick? I can't tell. It looks like it, right? Hello. Take me to your leader. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Uh, maybe we need to... Maybe it's because this is upside down. I don't think so, but I guess you never know. Okay, there we go. Maybe you have to turn this on now. That would be kind of cool. I doubt it. Now, that would be cool if you could actually have to turn that on. Anyway, let's go ahead and try this again. Huh. Yeah, I think this stick is broken. Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and take this one off. We'll just set it up there. We're going to get a brand new one. Oh, I think I got it. Okay, yep. Okay, let's see if they uh, pop up now. They're still not a populating. Hmm. And 
interesting. Well, I think the game broke on me. So I'm not seeing them. Okay, maybe they just don't exist anymore. Let's just kind of click around. No. Huh. Well, hell. Hell's freaking bells, as it were. Okay, okay. Maybe if we sleep or something, I'm not too sure. Uh, let's just try that, I suppose. Alright, let's try it again. No? No. Huh. Okay, well. Yeah, what's going on here? Why does this car not want to be welded? Or, oh, I'm an idiot. Okay, well, apparently I don't remember what the hell to do. Okay, never mind. Uh, we need to get the cutting frickin' pad. I'm stupid. Okay, anyway. Uh, we should have one in here. <laughs> Dumbass. All right, all right, all right. Where is the hell did I put the dang thing? Okay, come on. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking there. Weld. I thought I was torch cutting it, I suppose. Okay, let's get these off. Uh, we got this side. This one. That should be the only two. Indeed it is. Uh, let's see. We should have some rust back there. Yep. And let's do the same thing for this side. Check and a check, indeed. Let's go ahead and bring it over as well. There she is. Beautiful. And I think that's going to be all the rust. Let's just take a look real quick. Yeah, that's going to be it. It's already up to 10,000. Uh, let's go ahead and swap these out. There we go. And let's finish this up. Then we'll go ahead and get them painted. Oh, there we go. That was super easy. And this one? Okay, not as easy. That's okay, though. We can just... Okay, that was pretty easy. Okay, now before we put those on, we are going to actually get the paint that we need. Uh, which is going to be a 726E6A. E6A, 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 E6A. Okay, enter. That looks like the right color. Let's go ahead and get a spray can. We'll get two of them uh, because we also need to paint the hood. Uh, so let's go ahead and hit these real quick. There we go. Uh, let's grab this one real quick here. Oh, I see a little bit more rust down there. Do you see it? Okay, let's grab our grinder. Come on. And, uh, yep, there's still a little bit of rust down there. There we go. Gonna hit that with some paint. And we're just gonna rotate it around. And there's still a little bit of rust on this side as well. Beautiful, beautiful. I know it disappeared, but I'm gonna hit it anyway. And... There we go. I think that's going to be it. Yep. Looks like it. Ends don't get painted, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, let's grab the paint and... Well, let's rotate it first. There we go. And yeah, let's go ahead and get this painted real quick. Check and... Check. Oh, did we get it all? I think that's just a reflection. Okay, and we're just going to rotate it one more time. Make sure we got all of the spots. It looks like there's one tiny spot there that we missed. And there we go. Okay, we can get these back on. Uh, but before we do, uh, we're going to go ahead and just finish painting up the car. So we got that. It looks kind of weird, but I think it's okay. Uh, the door jam. Oh, there's some rust back there. Let's grab our grinder. There we go. And let's get this thing painted. Okay, we're a little bit close. Uh, there we go. And I think we got it. I think we got it. Um, we might have to take off the door. I can't remember. No, I think we got it all. Okay. There we are. Um, let's see. Right in the middle. Indeed. And right a little bit over here. And the outside of the door. Beautiful, beautiful, and I think that's it for that door. Uh, we do need to paint the hood, of course, uh, but let's grab this bumper real quick here. Check, check, check. Oops, easy. Okay, we need to get scooted up a little bit there. Okay, and we need to get it right inside there. There we go. And let's just kind of scroll. There we go. Yep, we're missing quite a bit inside here. Okay. I think we got the whole bumper. Let's go ahead and get the side fender. 
Okay. And what about this door? Looks like we have a little bit up top, a little bit down below, a little bit more down here. Um, you know what? We're going to have to pull that off. Um, let's go ahead and paint the hood first though. Okay. So we're a little bit too far away. Uh, let's see. It's always a little bit hard to get inside, uh, get way up there. You know what I mean? Oh, and we ran out. Okay. That's fine. We're going to just throw this one away or not and grab the other can and we're almost done with the paint job uh where was that spot at or did i get it all i think we got it all yeah i thought we missed some up here but apparently we got it okay uh let's just walk around real quick and make sure we got everything else we need that uh-huh maybe a little bit down here can't quite tell and nothing on the trunk okay well i think that might be it let's go ahead and just peek down here uh, let's look at the color condition okay we are definitely missing something so let's pull this door panel off and let's take a look under here nope looks good uh, maybe under the door. I see some paint that we missed. Okay. Uh, let me pick it up. There we go. Okay, let's try this here. We'll just kind of run underneath. And let's look at it. So we're definitely missing something. Um, let's pull up the hood. check inside here i don't remember if we got any rust in there no it doesn't appear so okay we're definitely missing something it might be up here on this front okay oh i know where it's probably on the inside of this hood here okay maybe let's see nope Color condition is always a freaking drag. Now nah, it doesn't look like there's anything that needs to be painted in here. And the only things that were different color was the hood and that one rocker, right? Oh, <laughs> genius. Right here. I didn't notice that was a freaking part. Okay, let's get this painted. Okay, that should be good now. Oh, it's not. Okay. Oh. Oh, why? Why, oh, why? Maybe uh, we need to shoot it just a little bit under here. I mean, it did look like it, so let's take a look. Okay, there we go. We got all five stars. Indeed. Okay, let's go ahead and throw on these rockers. So this will be the... I can't read it. Uh, the right. Okay, let's throw this one on. Get her welded down. Maybe. Okay, there they are. One and two. And let's throw this one on. Check. See if we could reach it from inside the car here. There they are. One and... Okay, it's a little bit hard to see. Okay, two. We got them. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at it real quick. Um, we're done with the welder, so we're just going to go ahead and take this back. Yeah. Well, maybe. Okay. Okay, there we go. Let's take a look at the overall condition real quick. All right, 12-7, and overall is uh, just sitting there at those stars. Let's get these door panels on. Uh, let's see if these work real quick here. Okay, so I do think this one's bad. Okay, I can see the broken, um, the broken line there. What about this one? Okay, they're both bad. Uh, so we are going to replace those. I didn't grab them at the junkyard, obviously. Uh, but that's okay. These don't cost the most. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, so we'll grab one of those for the left and one for the right. Oh, you know what? Oops. Okay. Damn it. I always do that. Okay, come on. Just pick it up, will you? Yeah, we'll grab new ones. Um, And let's see what else are we going to need before we head there. Oh, you know what? We have our... 
a visor over here that we need to put on. So let's grab the um, screwdriver. And of course I didn't leave it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on with this trailer? Uh, apparently this is moving around. So we are going to just pull this over. Hit the brake. There we go. Okay, so where's the screwdriver? We need to get that visor put on. There it is. Okay. All right, where's the visor? There she blows. Okay, let's get this on. I can't remember which side it was. Oh, it's this side. Okay. Uh, loosen. And checkity, checkity, check. Beautiful, beautiful. We do have a break, by the way. Everything in here does appear to look like it's in good condition. Uh, but yeah, you know what? I forgot. I have some white furniture in here. I don't know if I have a door panel or not, though, so let's find out. Not furniture, but uh, upholstery. Nope. We only got seats. That's fine. That's fine. I think our seats are just fine, though. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and grab those window things real quick. And how was this back panel, by the way? Okay, it looks good. Okay, yeah, so we just need the two windows. And yeah, we should be freaking fantastic. Let's go grab that. Or both of those, rather. This is going to be a pretty good, uh, pretty good flip, I think. Of course, we're, we will have to take it downtown to get the full price from it, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, hello, hello. Oh, hi. Hello. Uh, say, are you going in town today? No. If you do, bring me cigarettes, please. Oh, uh, uh, I'm running out. You know, I checked for those cigarettes and they don't have them, buddy. Okay, so these are for the coops, right? Indeed. So a left and a right. Uh, can we pocket these? Of course not. Of course not. Okay, that's fine. Well, we're just going to have to take them one by one. That's fine. Uh, this is the front right, so we'll just bring this over and let's go grab that other one real quick. Quick indeed. And I don't know what to do about this thing. I hate it. <laughs> and there we go. Yeah, that thing sucks, man. I tell you what, watch. This next one, we're going to pull with the Niv, and it's going to pull it so much better. All right, let's grab this other window frame. There we go, and we should be good to go. Uh, I think we do need to replace one of the tires, though. So we will check those tires before we completely finish, unless we get all five stars. Uh, then we'll just sell it as is. But And where did I leave the wrench? Hard to say. There she is, though. Okay, let's go ahead and pull off this window. What is this? Oh, I'm just dumb. I forgot. This is the left one. Okay, that's fine. Let's put this over here. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and pull the window off. Put it on the new one. Should be pretty simple. There we go. Can't quite see the window, but that's okay. And let's find the check mark. Tight. Tight. Let's go ahead and throw this on. Tight and tight. Very good. Let's do the same with this side now. We can't quite see this one, but we can come down and there we go. Okay. And then we just have to throw it on. Throw on the door panels. Uh, which one is not right there. Uh, they're going to be over here. So let's grab this white one. Yeah, you know, I don't know if I'm going to bother going to the upholstery shop and getting this to a perfect color match. Uh, let's take a look at it first. Yeah, let's go ahead and put this one on and see if we can get the five stars from it. There we go. Uh, let's take a look. Okay, so we aren't at a five stars yet, so we're definitely missing some stuff here. Um, what that could be, it's hard to say. But we have all good lights. We have good bumpers. We have good fuel tanks, good rear lights. Um, I might need a light bulb, so we might have to test that. Uh, what else could it be? What else could it be? Well, it could be the tires. So let's pull this back in and uh, swap out the bad tires real quick. That could definitely be the problem. Uh, I don't think we need to actually pull these out. I think it'll drive straight over it. So let's find out. Now, there, this thing is a little bit higher than... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, we might need to move these. Okay, let's move them. Indeed. Okay, let's see if we can push it forward now. Oh, we sure can. Okay, beautiful. Uh, back just a little bit. Yeah, pretty sure it's the tires. Which we'll probably just go, since we have white walls on here, we'll go ahead and buy the white walls. I have a bunch of tires in the shop here, uh, but none of them are white walls. So, oh, we don't even have the exhaust on. Well, we're geniuses. Okay, let's put that exhaust on real quick. Yep. Smarty, smarty, McFarty. Okay. Uh, here we go. Oh, there she is. Okay, oh, there it is. Oh, nope. That's the wrong thing. We need to hook it up uh, from inside here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, let's take a look now. Okay, still... Uh, we still don't have the five stars, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the tires. So let's lift her up. And let's see what we're dealing with here. Uh, these ones are pretty bald. Uh, these ones look... I don't know. They look like they have tread. Uh, these ones definitely look like tread. So it looks like we have two bald tires. Yeah, yeah. It looks like we have two. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and just grab those real quick. Uh, we're going to shut this while we're at it. There we go. So two white walls. Uh, shoot, I don't even know what size these are. Hold on. Yeah, I don't even know what size these are. So we're going to pull these off real quick and see. I think they're 15s, but I don't know. You can't really tell until we could tell. Oh, we need to paint this rim, by the way. Uh, so we will do that. What size is it? Okay, they're 14s. Let's grab that paint. There we go. Just Okay, she is painted. Had a little bit of an OBS crash, uh, but I did pull off that other tire. Let's go ahead and grab the new ones. They're both 14 white walls. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, if there's a little bit of gap. You wonder what happened. That's what happened. Okay. So let's hope it does not happen again. It was doing so good for the last couple of videos, but here are the 14s. Let's just buy both of them right off the bat and uh, just carry them over and then we'll get them swapped around. Okay, so we got both tires over here. Let's just bring it inside real quick and swap it out. Uh, let's just grab this tire here. Oops, or not. Uh, there we go. Get these switched around, get them pumped up. Uh-huh, and I think our tire pump's already out there, so that's fine. Uh, we'll just set this here for now, and let's go ahead and take this off. And we are almost done. We are almost done. All right, let's get these puppies tightened down, and we should be good to go. We should be good. We're going to grab our wrench real quick and slap them on. Oh, yeah, I forgot to see if these actually paint the back. Uh, oh, it didn't. Okay, I'm glad I checked. I don't think it's going to matter too much, but where's our paint at? There it is. Yeah, because we pretty much got the five stars already, right? Okay, we got it. Okay, where's the wrench? Where did the wrench go? Oh, it's right there. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's get this on. I see a little bit of a green in there. Uh, I'm not too worried about it. Tight. And let's cross our fingers. All right, we got full five stars all the way across the board. Let's just drop her. And I see a little bit of paint that I missed right here. Uh, let me grab that can real quick. There we go. Okay, let's get it dropped. And before we complete this, we're going to move all these junk parts real quick. There we go. Let's get her, get inside, get it started and backed up. Uh, before we do that, we will move these uh, first, just for good measure. Uh, we do need some hubcaps, by the way. By the way, by the way, let's go ahead and throw this one on. Oh, we still need to pump up the tires. Okay, where's the pump? And yeah, let's get these lifted up real quick. Fantastic. Uh, let's just double check these tires again. Good. And good. Okay, let's get in and back her up.
I'll take it for a little bit of a test drive here. Make sure she runs all freaking fancy like. There we go. Yes, yes. Reverse. Oh, we got the brake on. Okay, perfect. And we're just going to set it over here for the time. Brakes work good. Shut her off. Hit that brake. And jump out. All right. Well, there she freaking is. Uh, let's, do we have a good another good hubcap? Uh, we might just need to go ahead and buy those. Um, let's see real quick. Yeah, let's just go across the street and grab those hubcaps. I don't know where they're at. Uh, we're going to save again. Oh, I see them on the wall. Yep, here they are. Uh, so we need three 14s. Okay, and we should be able to pocket these, right? Okay, thank God. Okay. And let's throw these on and we'll be done. Let's get these all on. All right, yep, there she is, completely built. Let's see how much she's worth. Uh, 13.6, so if we get a 30% extra on it, that's uh, 1,300. Uh, 13, so 30%, 13, 26, 39. It's almost a $4,000 extra bonus. So 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, almost 18,000 we'll get this for, about 17.5 probably. So that is pretty good. That is pretty freaking good. Okay, well, that's going to be it for this one. We're not going to sell it right away. Um, what I'm thinking of doing next is we still have like 29 point five thousand we basically have thirty thousand dollars left so what i think we're going to do next is just start buying a bunch of these um down at the junkyard spawn them up here right and uh just kind of go to town and do a bunch of repairs and kind of collect a good cars and then once we run out of money we'll just sell them all and see where we land right and we should definitely have enough money at that point to upgrade the garage but that will be it for this one you guys hope you enjoyed let me know what you think and of course, we will see you guys in the next one. Later on, everybody. All right, well, I guess I'll leave this in for you uncut bastards, but what we are going to be doing is the outro for the video. I keep forgetting to do this on every one, but yep, here we go. Oops, on, we gotta change our view. <laughs> okay, anyway, later on, guys.